Hello and welcome. Here at Passmark Software, we are excited to introduce our latest hardware product, the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro. This new product is a diagnostic tool for analyzing USB power delivery and charging behavior. It features a sync port for testing power providing devices like USB chargers and PC ports, and a source port that emulates different charges to assess how devices respond. With this tester, you can quickly evaluate the power, performance and compatibility of USB ports. With the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro, you can test the power delivery capability of USB ports, Thunderbolt ports, USB chargers and USB power banks by dissipating up to 240 watts continuously from these devices using the sync port. Check if a USB host can deliver its maximum specified wattage and its output voltage levels remain within specification under high load. Detect the wattage a USB charger claims to support, which in turn controls the charging speed of mobile phones and other USB connected battery devices. Test USB Type-C cables for voltage drops by measuring the voltage across the cable, the power rating of the cable, and the maximum supported speed. Determine the actual capacity of power banks by discharging them at your specified load. Emulate USB chargers with a configurable 100 watt source port to check if a device can be powered or charged with different types of chargers. Accurately measure the current consumption and the power usage of USB devices such as smartphones or power banks. And use it with the USB 3 loopback plug to test communication, speed, data integrity and power delivery of USB ports simultaneously. Each USB Power Delivery Tester Pro comes with four cables to ensure full testing capabilities. Included in the package is a power adapter for powering the device, a 40 centimeter 240 watt USB Type-C to Type-C EPR cable for high power EPR charges, a 40 centimeter USB A to USB Type-C cable for testing with USB A devices, a 40 centimeter 100 watt E marked USB Type-C to Type-C cable for connecting to USB Type-C devices and chargers, and a 1 meter USB A to micro B cable for connecting the tester's analysis port to a PC. To power up the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro, start by connecting the provided power adapter to an AC outlet. Then, plug the adapter into the power connector at the back of the unit. Finally, switch on the power using the power button located at the back and the tester will be ready for use. With the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro powered up, we can begin testing a USB power supply by connecting it to the sync port. In this example, we are using our 140 watt laptop charger. Once connected, the tester will scan the charger to identify the supported protocols. This information is displayed on the first menu page, providing an overview of all available charging standards. Navigating further, clicking on a specific protocol reveals a detailed list of options. From here, we can select a protocol, trigger it and negotiate a desired voltage level. After selecting a profile, we can adjust the current draw from the charger to any desired amount. For chargers that support an adjustable voltage supply, the voltage can also be fine-tuned. The USB Power Delivery Tester Pro can also be controlled from a PC via the analysis port. By connecting to a Windows computer and launching the included test application, the software will automatically detect and connect to the tester. Using the software, we can perform various tests. In this example, we'll be testing the 5 volt output using a voltage versus current sweep test. 
This test gradually increases the current from 0 amps to the charge's claimed maximum, generating a graph that plots voltage at each step. The results confirm that the charger maintains a stable voltage output over the entire range, ensuring compliance with the USB power delivery standards. The source port emulates different chargers, allowing you to create up to five virtual chargers with up to 15 profiles each. It delivers up to 100 watts, making it ideal for testing devices like phones and tablets to see how they handle various charging technologies. In this example, we're testing how a Samsung phone responds to different charging protocols. We've set up five common charger configurations and are quickly toggling between them. As we switch, the phone increases its current draw when the power delivery protocol is supported, boosting its charging speed. It also prefers 9 volts when available, further improving charging efficiency. Using the Windows Test Application, or API, we can create and modify these emulated chargers. Let's change the 10 watt power delivery charger to a 15 watt power delivery charger and see how the phone reacts. With a 15 watt power delivery charger, we can see that the current draw is higher than it was with the 10 watt power delivery charger. From this testing, it can be concluded that we need at least 15 watts of power to charge this phone at the fastest speed. The provided Windows test application can also be used to do further tests on the mobile phone to get more data about the device. One example of this is using the built-in graphing tools to generate a graph of the voltage and current over time. One example of this is using the built-in graphing tools to generate a graph of the voltage and current over the entire charging process of the mobile phone. Loopback mode allows the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro to work in conjunction with a Passmark USB loopback plug, enabling simultaneous testing of communication speed, data integrity, and power delivery on USB ports. In this example, we want to test if the data communication on a HP laptop's USB port will still function while the USB port is stressed at outputting its maximum power. To set up this test, we firstly enable loopback mode from the settings, then connect the laptop to a sync port, and finally connect a Passmark USB 3 loopback plug to the loopback port. With the setup complete, we can now set the load to the maximum the USB port supports and begin a loopback test from which we can see if there are any errors in the data communication and the maximum read or write speed. Bootback mode can also be used with other devices such as mobile phones or USB flash drives. When using loopback mode, the power and data lines between the two ports are connected together, allowing the Power Delivery Tester Pro to be inserted into an already existing system and apply additional load while monitoring the voltage and current. In this example, we place the Power Delivery Tester Pro between a USB charger and a mobile phone. At first, the phone charges at 5 volts for a short time before negotiating with the charger to select 9 volts once it detects that it supports it. The charger also chooses to charge at 1.3 amps, which is much below the maximum power the charger claims to support. Using loopback mode, we can stress the charger to output its maximum power, allowing us to see what happens when the worst case scenario occurs and give us confidence it will function safely in any circumstance. The maximum current the charger can output is 3 amps, so we will increase the load the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro adds until reaching at maximum. From this, we can see that the phone's charge has remained unaffected, showing that the charger performs reliably when pushed to its full capacity. The USB Power Delivery Tester Pro has a range of settings that can be configured to adjust its behaviour as a device, giving it the ability to run more advanced test cases. In this example, we will configure the tester to simulate a faulty device that ignores a charger's current limit, 
and then connect this to a charger to test if it has the ability to safely protect itself from a faulty device. For this test, we will use an Apple laptop charger that allows a maximum of 2.4 amps at 5 volts. As the current is increased slowly, we can see that the charger has been over-designed as it has no problems when the maximum current is exceeded. Once the current reaches close to 4 amps, the overcurrent protection mechanism is triggered in the charger and the connection is reset to save the charger from any damage. This behaviour is expected in a well-designed charger as it keeps itself safe when a faulty device is connected. Using the API with the USB Power Delivery Tester Pro allows for automated testing, providing greater flexibility and efficiency by enabling custom test configurations and logging without manual intervention. In this example, we have a USB power bank and we want to check how much it has degraded over time with use. The best way to do this is to monitor the full discharge process of the battery, although this can take a very long time to complete and is tedious to do manually. To solve this problem, we have created a script using the API, which completely automates the process and removes the need for any tedious manual work. For this test script, we choose the voltage and current we want to discharge the battery at, after which the test begins logging the entire discharge process and checking that an acceptable output is maintained. We can then come back once the battery is fully drained to review the results of the test. For more information or to purchase a USB Power Delivery Tester Pro, visit Passmark.com.